Hey friends and welcome back to my channel. This video is about fixing the issue with GTA 5 while launching the game. You got a black screen while entering the online story mode or just after the Rockstar Games logo. So without wasting time, let's go ahead and directly proceed with the resolution. First of all, in the basic step, if you have installed OneDrive into your system, for example at my end, here is my OneDrive. Click on this gear icon and then click on the option quit OneDrive. Make sure you quit the OneDrive. Then head over to this PC, from the left main, click on the option documents. Now over here, you will find a folder with the name Rockstar Games. First of all, right click and choose the option copy. Paste the folder onto your desktop to make a backup so that if anything goes wrong, you can easily restore this folder. Then right click on Rockstar Games folder and choose the option delete. Once it is deleted, go ahead and try to relaunch the game to fix out the issue of GTA 5 black screen while entering online or story mode. Now if this method failed to work out, first of all go ahead and restore the Rockstar Games folder. Now open the Rockstar Games folder, GTA 5, here right click on the settings file and choose the option open with and click on the option notepad. Here press the Control F key to open the search box and type in DX and hit the enter key. Now over here you will find a line with the name DX version value is 2. From here change the value from 2 to 0. Then click on the file menu and choose option save. Now go ahead and relaunch your game to fix out the issue of black screen while entering online or story mode. Now if this method also will to work out, let's proceed to the third step. In third step, open up your browser and here I have a VPN with the name Warp VPN. Scroll down and download it into your system. Save it wherever you want and then wait for it to finish downloading it into your PC. Now once it is downloaded, click on it to install the Cloudflare Warp VPN into your PC. Proceed with the on-screen instructions. This will go ahead and install the Cloudflare Warp VPN into your PC. Once installed, the Warp VPN will be shown right in this taskbar. So click on it and then simply proceed with the on-screen instructions and then you need to turn or toggle on this particular switch. Now once it is seen connected, go ahead and relaunch your GTA 5 to completely fix out the issue of GTA 5 black screen while entering online story mode or after the Rockstar Games logo. Now with this method also will to work out, let's proceed with the next step. In next step, what you need to do is to first of all launch your Rockstar Games launcher into your system. Do not use Steam or Epic Games while launching the GTA 5. Simply go ahead and launch the Rockstar Games launcher into your system. Now sign in using your user ID and password. Now once sign in process is completed, only then launch your Epic Games Launcher or the Steam and then hit on the play option to launch the GTA 5 using the Steam or Epic. But make sure Rockstar Games Launcher must be running before you launch Steam or Epic Games Launcher into your system. If this method also failed to work out, first of all close the Rockstar Games Launcher into your system. Open Task Manager and make sure that the Rockstar Launcher or the Steam Games or not running are not running into a PC. If it is running, right click and choose the option End Task as I have done right over here. Then close it. Now open up your browser and here I have a Revo installed. Scroll down and simply download its portable version into your system. Go ahead, save it into a PC. Once it is downloaded, open the zip folder, drag and drop the folder inside the zip folder to unzip it completely into your system. Now open unzip folder, right click on Revo U port and choose the option run as administrator. Now all the installed programs will be shown right in front of you. Under the applications, find Rockstar Games SDK, Rockstar Games Launcher as well as GTA 5. Once you find all three files, here is GTA 5. Click on Rockstar Games Launcher, choose the option Uninstall. Completely uninstall Rockstar Games Launcher from your system. Then uninstall Rockstar Games and lastly uninstall GTA 5 by clicking on this option Uninstall. After installing, it will ask you to clear the registries. So make sure you select the option Moderate and then clear the registries of the GTA 5 
as well as Rockstar Games Launcher. Once the program is completely uninstalled, restart your PC and after restarting, reinstall the game using Steam, Epic or the GTA 5 website and this will completely fix out the issue of GTA 5 black screen while entering online story mode or after the Rockstar Games logo. So as of now, this is all about it friends. If this video works out for you, I request you to please click on the subscribe button and turn on the bell notification icon to continue receiving updates from my channel. Thank you so much friends. Thank you for watching.